There are many ways to capture an image of your computer screen. In this video, we step you through two methods of taking a screenshot in Windows 10, with a keyboard shortcut or using a Windows tool. Use your keyboard keys to capture a print screen. Depending on your computer model or the type of keyboard you're using, the shortcuts for a print screen are located in different places. On a Dell laptop, print screens are normally done with the end key. To use it, you need to press the function key and the end key simultaneously. Then you need to open the Paint app and paste it. You also have the opportunity to edit the image. If you prefer to capture just a specific window, but not the entire screen, use the shortcut with the Windows logo key and the print screen key. Some laptops require using the Windows logo key and the function key with the print screen key. These are helpful options when you're using more than one monitor. Microsoft has a tool in Windows which has different names depending on the version of Windows you're using. Older Windows versions have what is called the snipping tool, but newer versions have Snip and Sketch. You can find Snip and Sketch on the list of apps or open it by pressing the Windows logo key and Shift S. Click on New to utilize the clip options. Rectangular, Freeform, and Full Screen. Use full screen for a screenshot and the image should be saved to the clipboard. Otherwise, save as to store it wherever you want. The snipping tool is accessible via the search bar. To capture a print screen, use the mode Window, then click on the screen to select it. Save as, name the image, and then save it. For either tool, the last mode used becomes the snip default next time you click on New. Anytime you need help or have questions, be sure to contact us through social media on Facebook or Twitter. Visit the Dell Community Forum to chat with other Dell users. Check out our other videos on the Tech Support Dell channel and subscribe today. If you like this video, give it a like and thanks for watching.